In this video, we are going to install GUI graphical user interface on Ubuntu Server 22.04. Hi, my name is Salhali and welcome back to my channel. So today we are going to install graphical user interface on Ubuntu server. So in our previous video, I showed you how you can install Ubuntu server. If you want to watch that video, you can click on the link above on the i button. So for that, uh, you need a running instance of Ubuntu server 22.04 and the root user access. So right now I'm logged in as the test user. Let me change the user and for that the command is sudo su and I type dash in the end. So uh, you type the password and then it changes to root. So the dash mean it directly goes into the root directory uh, going uh, rather than going into the other uh, directories. Okay, so first of all, we're going to update this whenever you're going to install anything on uh, your Ubuntu server make sure you update it and if you see any errors you need to fix those first and then you can install uh, anything whatever you want uh, the open source packages okay so after updating this we are going to install uh, and a package called task cell so for that the command is apt install task cell and I will provide all the commands in the description of this video so you don't need to be worried about the commands if I'm typing so fast or uh, things are going so fast you just see the description of this video and you will find all the commands okay so the next command is going to be apt install Ubuntu desktop so that package is actually going to uh, going to be the one for graphical user interface. So as I told you in the start of my Ubuntu series that there are two types of Ubuntu. Uh, one is Ubuntu desktop and the other one is server. So on server side you just uh, use the command line and for the GUI version it's same uh, can't say same like Windows but it's like very similar to uh, the Windows. So make sure you type everything correct apt install Ubuntu desktop okay so it's almost 2 GB package that's going to take a few minutes let me pause the video okay so it took like 15 to 20 minutes and it depends on your internet speed if your internet speed is good then it's gonna take like a couple seconds depending on your internet speed my uh, on my home router it's like under 100 mbps so that's why it took like 15-20 uh, minutes okay so, uh, so now we are going to provide the last command and uh, which is going to be uh, for the GDM the genome uh, graphical uh, user display manager okay so for that you need to type apt install GDM and uh, has no installation candidate let me check for this error okay so it says in GDM has no installation candidate uh, package is not available but it refers by another package this may be uh, missing or obsolete so let me just reboot it and try again okay so the GDM was already installed with the command uh, Ubuntu desktop now you can see it's showing me the desktop on Ubuntu server so it's showing me this user as well and uh, if I click on this one it's going to ask for the password I think the password was this uh, yes it accepted and now the Ubuntu server is uh, having the GUI function so that's how you install the GUI on Ubuntu server. If you have any kind of questions, you can comment me below 
and uh, this was my first time i was installing this i did not do any testing before this so whatever happened in this video that was the real time installation and uh, i hope you understood all the installation i'll put all the commands in the description i'll see you in the next video thank you so much for watching bye bye